What's up guys, how you all doing? For today's video I'm going to unbox a whole bunch more gadgets. Let's see what they're all about. This is a pool start fire and they have designed them a little smaller now available. No matches, no candling, light, wet, wood, uh, windproof, rainproof, burns for 30 minutes. So that little block will by itself burn for 30 minutes. That's why it will dry out a bigger logs like this and the idea is put the green um, little ropey onto a big log and then cover them up with the other logs on top of them like build it just like that and um, pull on a red stain it will set on fire so quick and easy I have put them to the test they have changed the log a little bit and a little bit of this uh, size so let's go try it out start it on fire see what it looks like right and now all I have to do build it up and just grab it with the ropes and hold it way back and it started I see the smoke you know what I have pulled it too hard so we do not want to pull it hard we want to pull it gradually pulled it too fast but for fun let's see oh wow look at that that is crazy so you know what this is actually a safety and it worked really well it says right here pull firmly to take off the safety there you go now it's ready to be activated so now we know this is definitely new because i reviewed this before and i did not need that before so let's put it to the rack and let's pull it really nice and firmly right here and see what happens and now it works really well easily and it looks like just like a little flare that's it the way it burns just like a flare and it's going to burn for uh, 30 minutes easily and if I have to put it out it's actually very easy to put it out just like a regular fire starter it just have a flare inside of it that is uh, what do you call it lighting it up so good tech accessory been doing a lot of them they are so awesome so this one is pretty unique it's kind of strange looking but first of all there's a screwdriver uh, looks like a some sort of a bottle opener but what it is, it goes into the belt. So the keys, I guess, going to connect somewhere here. And that will sit inside the, I don't know if there's explanation, but that is slip ring, uh, plier wedge. They said here, pocket uh, hanger slot. So they will go into the pocket and the keys will be connected into here on the key ring. Pretty unique little gadget. Oh, look, and let's see what else I found. There's a little a multi tool, eight tools in one. It's like almost like a keychain size. But what's, what what's so unique about it? It has scissors instead of pliers at the end there. So let's unbox it carefully. Very good spring. Wow. Have to hold it almost tight. Probably with one hand like this and this hand free. Um, looks like a high quality let's close it the rest of the stuff on the other side push it together Ooh, what is this Ugh. okay there it is there's a little knife open boxes and so on um this one is a serrated knife very good okay what's this else is in there let's close these two things so we can pull the other stuff out might have to open that one to get to this one unless this is like a nothing uh, not really sure how I'm supposed to take this out some of these things are kind of hard to pull out we'll look at it in a second okay what is this ooh nice a little bottle opener a screwdriver awesome I guess this is just letting us know what that is cool um, a little pick 
smaller screwdriver and another screwdriver right here with the file six oh there's another one lanyard hole so eight tool side here this in the middle it just uh, holds everything together but yeah pretty impressive for such a small kitchen tool with scissors you can hold it this way but i think the most comfortable way for me is to hold it this way this spring assist is so powerful got it here another multi-tool tent stake puller interesting okay carabiner right here and tent stake puller which one it would be oh this one right here so this is a hook it stakes and pull them out with leverage like this that's cool i like it so it's perfect for camping gonna lift it and close it um nice carabiner Ooh, assisted scissors okay just close that this way very solid tool wow that is a nice couple inches knife right here liner lock thick blade so I said here easy to pull out so I might have to close one to pull the other one out oh man that's tight right there let's see there you go there's another like knife punch with like a drop point blade okay what else carabina is this a fire striker striker no this is perfect tweezers what a nice thing to have take out the splinter and so on very solid layer tool there's a like a grinder over here of some sort and yeah and it can be hung onto a backpack a carabina i like it very cool okay a little survival kit by i mean uh, first aid kit by coleman let's see what's all about Okay, mini tin survival first aid kit, stin relief pods, nice, anodized towelette, antiseptic towelette, I'm sorry, and then we have more creams, no, another, triple antibiotic, this stuff is good, I really like that a lot, good to have for scratches, that is in the mud, there is the blade in here, and band-aid bigger band-aids smaller band-aids and couple of the uh, what do you call this bulava bulavka whatever i don't know anyways safety pin there it there is sometimes i got think super solid little survival kit i would load up on um triple antibiotic but yeah looks like it has some space i like it Okay, found this unique Lagagic a lighter locator. So what's so special about that? Let's see, let's open it. It has right here like a holder with a magnet inserted inside there. Yeah. Very cool. So in case I need a lighter in the same spot uh, in the garage on the metal section boom i have a lighter always there ready to go that is so cool so kind of just uh, plugged in on any metal very interesting i like it the attachment okay what else we can find out here sog uh gumbit beautiful looks like a car bit except this one is a gumbit okay let's open it carefully okay see what it's all about also there is the knife shift definitely need that so first of all i would not hold it this way it doesn't feel comfortable um maybe this way so more comfortable but e either way unique little fixed blade full tang with couple of like a plastic handle there's a finger grip so it doesn't slip and it's really goes in there really well 
Um, which way? Obviously this way. Why is it not locking? Ooh, look at this two little things in there. It locks in there tight. And this side here, spinnable. I like it. So it can go onto the pocket like sideways onto a belt. Ooh, it's also movable and can be placed on the other side. And it's a clicky side there. Or can go this way. Oh, it gets tightened. Can go this way. Either way, can go onto like a um, backpack strap this way, so I can easily pull it out. Very cool. And boom, just pull on that, and it opens pretty easily. And to push it in there, takes a little bit of a push, but it slides in really well. Easy to detach it. I like it. Sog has a really nice fixed plate size for sure. Also, we're talking about these little lighters. Let's see what this one's is all about. This like a little kitchen attachment, non-magnetic. Let's grab another lighter. So any big lighter will work. And let's see. Wow, it fits so good. It's not going to slide off. Look, this thing before will break off before this will slide off. I'll have to push it off this way to replace the lighter fluid and stuff. So nice there, carabiner attachment. Boom, can hang it onto a backpack, bring it camping. This lighter is pretty much waterproof. If they get wet in a environment, all we have to wait is dry it off for a few minutes and it will work again. So this is perfect, I could hang it onto a backpack, I'll have a lighter to go camping. What an awesome gadget. Let's see how easy it is to remove it. Not easy, but possible. Easy enough to refill it or put a new one in. I don't know if this one is refillable, there it is. Big lighter attachment right here. Folding boxes, they are so awesome. This one comes with a lid. I don't necessarily need a lid, so it opens this way and unfolds. It locks in, I like to give it a little top on the inside. And I have here really big, durable boxes. I like bring it with me into the car. I also always have it in case I need to pull out a bunch of groceries. Boom, and it comes with a nice lid in here. It locks in. So one more time. It is brand new. So like this, so it will be easier to open it and close it once it's loosened up a little bit and there's a lid on top of it. Boom, and it's stackable too. I love that. So this is the only way to have boxes. There you go.